We begin with new details in a story that was breaking on Eyewitness News Live at 5. David Caprio, the state's Democratic Party chairman, has stepped down. Now this comes as we're learning an investigation has been launched into a state contract that was awarded to his company. So let's get right to Eyewitness News reporter Kelly Sullivan, who's working the breaking details live in the newsroom. Well, Caprio held the position as Democratic Party chairman for less than a year, and his departure happening at a critical time just weeks before the primary elections. The development comes as the Rhode Island State Police confirmed they have launched an investigation into beach concession contracts awarded to Caprio's company. Caprio launched the business in 2013, according to state business filings reviewed by Eyewitness News. State police confirmed the investigation centers around Caprio's company. Now, in a statement, Caprio did not mention the state police investigation, but he points to the demands of the job. It reads in part, quote, the position of Democratic Party chair is demanding and time consuming, especially in an election year. There are numerous talented Democrats seeking office. I cannot at this time dedicate the necessary time and energy to assist them in their respective campaigns. Now, you may recognize the last name Caprio as part of a powerful political name here in Rhode Island. Now, his brother, former state treasurer Frank Caprio, is once again seeking that office, and his father is a Providence Municipal Court judge. Reporting in the newsroom, I'm Kelly Sullivan, Eyewitness News.